welcome back to the channel. This is Kara, AKA the Principal Painter. And today I've got some unboxings for you. The first ones are special drill projects. And I'm excited about this one because I've never seen this one before uh, unboxed. I may have missed somebody unboxing them, but I thought they were so pretty. And when I went out to look at special drill projects, I saw these and went, Okay, I've never seen these before. So you see the mandala on it. It is a box. Both of these are storage boxes. So I'm gonna get into them and let you know how I'm going to do these because they do, sorry, lots of plastic today, because they do expand into boxes, which is fun. So I'll show you that in a moment. But I'm gonna show you, so you drill, and for again, for those of you that are new, special drills projects are mostly partials. I will be drilling a lot on this, and, and this is the sticky part. The white part you see is not sticky, but it's a box. So let me see if I can get this, oh, open for you. Check that out, and I can use these boxes for storage in my craft room. So I am fired up for these. I have never seen these before. I did find these on Amazon and I just looked up special drills projects and these popped up and I again will link the link below for you. But what I love about it is you can collapse the box, it's the bottom of the box, and drill it flat and then pop it open when you're finished and you have a beautiful box. And I got two of them. So again, basic toolkit cheapo tweezers. I will never use those tweezers. A boat, wax, and a pen. And the drills. Let's check out these drills because there are special shaped drills in most of your special diamond painting. Okay, I got a little separate bag with hearts. These are hearts. Aren't they pretty? Oh my gosh, they're tiny. No, no, no. They're not hearts. They're teardrops. So, can you pan in, Marlon, so they can see those? It's a little tiny bag. Okay, and for the rest of the drills, what we have for this particular mandala. Oh, this is gonna be so pretty. And there's a lot to drill on this, so that'll be fun. All right, these are the eye-shaped or marquee. Here, and obviously a deep turquoise blue. This is an iridescent pink. Again, it's picking up a lot of colors. Marquee. Ooh, a purple marquee. That's pretty. A, a gold marquee. Some AB white diamonds. And again, AB stands for Aurora Borealis. They have a special coating on them, and if Marlin can pan in so you can see that coating, it just, again, shimmy shim shimmers, just a little bit brighter than regular drills. We've got some beautiful green rhinestones, some gold rhinestones, red rhinestones, ooh, kind of a deep red rhinestone, beautiful pink rhinestone, and a beautiful blue rhinestone. And those are all gonna go here. Here is your key. On most of these special projects I found, they're not gonna have the DMC codes on them, which is fine because they're special drills and they wouldn't, but they number them and then they show the symbols where you place each, each baggie. Now what I do on these special kits, and I'm still working on my Safari kit that I unboxed and showed you, I will just take one of these baggies, like say I wanna work on symbol number six. So I go to six, find the star, and I will do all of the stars on the kit. So I can just cut this open. I don't have to kit up, it's very easy. I just dump these into my tray, tape the excess plastic down, and then when I'm ready to come back to it, I can open it up. So that's how I do that. Don't forget this little baggie. And the next one I love, oops, let me put my key over there. It's a beautiful tree. And again, it has mandalas within the tree. And again, the white part you don't drill, but the, 
the parts that show the different shapes and the different dottings of the diamonds you do. So let's look at this. <clears throat> Key out here. This annoying plastic. Okay, so let me test the sticky. Oh yeah, it's very sticky. I'm gonna have such a good time on these. Again, you can drill them flat, which is great, and then pop them open. There is a part in the bottom that you put down to make it a little bit more sturdy, and I, I can use both of these as storage boxes in my craft room. I love these, and I haven't seen them before. So, here is your key. Again, one through 12 colors, and you know, they're your symbols and you just look for your symbols. And again, I do one symbol at a time and just do the whole, uh, do the whole project with the symbols. Basic toolkit, yeah. So let's look at the drills. Okay, no little baggies in here. Go. Okay, I'm going to show you the backs of these bags and not share the numbers with you because you can see them better if I do it that way. Okay, we have got some gold marquee or eyes because they're kind of in the shape of an eye. Oh, some beautiful turquoisey blue. Some silver eyes. Here are some beautiful green rhinestones, and these are domed. They're not faceted, which means they don't have the cuts on the top of them. Here is a gold rhinestone. Deep blue rhinestone, that's pretty. Ooh, look at this purple. That makes me smile. I love that purple. All right, looks like some plain uh, black drills to possibly outline your project. Beautiful green rhinestones, pink rhinestones, love that color. Some more red rhinestones, and again, some silvery rhinestones. So that is gonna be, again, fun to do. I love special projects. They work up quickly and allow you to get done with your project uh, more quickly. Let me put these aside. Here. Oh no, I'm not ready for the Diamond Art Club yet, but I will. I'll get to the Diamond Art Club. One more special project. And I have seen these before numerous times, but I wanted to get one just for my personal use. It is. Get it out of here. Hello. Come on. Oh. Hmm. Struggle bus. Okay. It is a journal. And again, it has another mandala on it. And if you open it up, the pages are not lined, but that's okay with me. I have never done a journal before. Again, done pencil boxes, done keychains, that sort of thing, but I've never done a journal before. It's nice. And again, drill field, very sticky. And obviously, as you can see, it's got lots of special shapes in it. So let's get to the drills and see what you got. Again, another basic toolkit. This one doesn't even come with tweezers, which is fine with me. <clears throat> and here are the drills. Sorry, again, lots of plastic in these. Hold on, get another plastic. Okay, let's see what we got to drill this kit with. Okay, wow! <gasps> Marlin pan in on that. I have never seen a special shape like that. It's not, it's got facets on the top of it, but they're different than just the regular cuts. Oh, that's so beautiful. I'm seeing turquoise and yellow and purples. That's gonna be gorgeous teardrops. Here's a beautiful faceted purple teardrop. Pink marquee. Iridescent turquoise marquee. Ooh, those purples are cool. They're domes, they're not faceted, but they're beautiful and purple, kind of a purplish pearl. Here's another green rhinestone. A beautiful cobalt blue rhinestone. 
kind of an orangish goldish rhinestone. These are the standard size drills. Two purples, lighter and darker purple. Those are gorgeous. Ooh, that's a pretty orange rhinestone. Lighter blue rhinestone. And a green rhinestone. So that's gonna be gorgeous when I get it done. Wanted to try a journal. Hadn't tried one, wanted to try it. Put this back in the bag, in the tool kit. I will struggle with putting the journal back in at a later time. All right, last thing I have to unbox, and I'm excited about this. I saw this the other day on Diamond Art Club, and it just hit me and meant a lot to me because of the times that we're living in, and we've got, I'm getting ready to go back to school, other schools are getting ready to go back to school. We're all kind of nervous and scared about that, but I saw this, and I just thought, you know what, I'm going to do this and I'm going to put it in my office because this meant a lot to me. And when I saw it, it just gave me a sense of peace. It is healing and it's an angel. And so I'm going to open it up and I'll tell you a story about, um, I ask my mother a question all the time about angels. And so I'll show you real quick. So let's get it out. Okay, so you can see from the pink that it is a round, and it does say it's round on the front, so you don't have to guess. Blue means it's square. You do get a special sticker, and I'm sorry, the artist is Sharon Cummings. It is a 51 by 74 centimeter, although it looks to be a partial. It may not be. I will open it up and find out, and it has ABs in it, so I will be putting this in my diamond painting journal. All right, we have two ABs in this kit, 133 and 141. And again, it's around 51 by 74, and it's called Healy. And you can, this, this uh, entire inventory sheet is a sticker. Uh, you can cut these off and put them on your containers to kit up if you would like. So that's a very nice feature that Diamond Art Club uh, has. And you get a toolkit. Square toolkits from uh, Diamond Art Club have the tweezers. This is a round, so it doesn't. You get your basic pen, you get baggies, you get a squishy, two deals of heart wax, and a clear boat with a funnel. So that's your basic Diamond Art Club toolkit. Don't always show the toolkit, but sometimes people get on here that are new and they want to see it. So, Okay, let's open it up. Open it up then, because <laughs> I can't get the drills out. Oh my gosh, look at this. I had not seen this before on Diamond Art Club. It's a beautiful angel, that's the angel of healing. Let me roll her back really quickly. So when I was a little girl, and my mother and I would be talking about religion, angels, all that kind of thing. And I would always ask my mother, Mom, do angels have feet? And again, you can roll this back. It is a poured glue. It is a partial. But I always roll it back and do a little zhuzhing to get it to flatten out. They, they flatten out beautifully. I would always ask my mother, do angels have feet? Because they'd always be in these long flowing gowns and I never could see their feet. Well, I can see her feet in this diamond painting, which makes me smile as well. So... Again, in this world where everything is kind of uncertain, I just found a lot of peace in this. And it is a partial. I've only unboxed one other partial from Diamond Art Club, but I saw this and I thought, I am getting that. So, number one and number two, 133 and 141 are the ABs. You can see twos all in the wings. There's ones in the wings. Um, there's ones here. Sure. Yep, they're ones in the halo. So, yeah, so those are your ABs. 
let me, oh, there's again, twos, all, all these white areas and her wings are all twos. They're all ABs. So her wings are gonna shim, shim, shimmy, shimmer. I'll flip her over and show you the drills. You also get step-by-step uh, -step instructions to diamond painting along with a coupon code to get 10% off of your next diamond art club that comes with it. We're gonna crinkle again. Try to make it as painless as possible. Ooh. Oh. Yeah. I am fired up for these colors, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh. Okay. This is challenging my wingspan here. <laughs> All right, let's get into these colors. Here is 966. And immediately we're hit with an A. Oh, I'm sorry, upside down. Sorry, 996. We're hit with your first AB, and that's a lot of ABs in a pack. 141. Again, Aurora Borealis coating gives it another just level of shine. 796. I can love 796. That's one of my favorite purples. 3846. 995, a beautiful blue. 3843, another really pretty blue. 3845, kind of a turquoise. 820, deep purple. 3844, beautiful blue. Love that. 783, 939. Again, I have a hard time distinguishing 939 from 310, but. I will do my best to get it up correctly. 3811, beautiful blue. 834, yellowish, topish. 823, I believe that is a dark purple or a dark blue. 606, beautiful red color. 955, another beautiful, kind of a light green. 321, another red, 782, brownish taupey color, and here's your other AB. It's going to be orange, 133. That is going to be beautiful. I'm excited about that, but look at all that 141, guys. That's a lot of ABs. That's going to be fun to do. Okay, let's look at the babies. <clears throat> We got 743, a yellow, 550, a purple, 758, another kind of topishy, orangey, beige, 992, it's a beautiful green, Six, lots of greens in this, 699, another darkish Kelly green, 740, an orange, 993, a little bit lighter, bluish green. More green, guys. 700 and 991. 991's a little bit darker than 700. 498, a light cranberry. 702, pretty green. Like that color. 3371. Oh, wow. Dark brown, sort of cranberry. 977, which, which, Wait a minute, that's a square in there. How did you get in there? It's a square. Trying to have fun with the 977 rounds. You are far from home. 780, light brown. 954, beautiful green again. Lots of green in this. 814, a cranberry. 775, powder blue. 666, everybody's favorite red. To be pretty. 677, cream color, and 728, another pretty yellow. So lots of beautiful colors in this, and a very, again, peaceful angel. I will flip her over again for you. Did you see her again in all her splendor? It is a partial. Sorry, I'm not going to step around here. It is a partial, the white, you do not drill. You drill the angel and the halo. But I love that. And I love that it's called healing because all of us need a little bit of healing during these times. So 
I'm excited to start this. Let me check out the canvas. I don't have to, but I want you to see it very sticky. Okay, Marlon, can you pan them in close to the drill field so you can see the clarity of the drills? Got it? Oh. Should I <clears throat> bring it there up you to go. you? Yeah, that's, oh yeah, that's good, I can see it. Awesome, okay. So you can see, again, the clarity of the drill field is never an issue with Diamond Art Club. And I love her feet. So angels do have feet. Don't ask me why I asked that question, but I always did. Okay, folks, those are the items that I have to share with you today. Hopefully you got something out of it. It was great to spend my Thursday evening with you. I'm gonna remind you before I go, in a world where you can be anything, be kind. This is The Principal Painter, and I am signing off.